Hi, good evening, bonsoir, and welcome to Paris. Today, it is the game of the season. It is the Classico. It is the Classique, whichever way you want to call it. It's Paris Saint-Germain versus Marseille. I'm here in Paris for PSG Talk, and I'm ready, I'm pumped up. I'm at the beautiful Eiffel Tower, and I'm ready to get three points tonight. Guys, we are about down 15 in kickoff, and I'm um, just walking down road that leads to the Parc de Prince. Um, a bit of a cold, soggy evening with um, some good mood around, for sure. I think um, it's going to be interesting tonight in terms of the atmosphere, but certainly, you know, people in high spirits around the stadium now, a the boutique there, and um, I'm good, I'm ready to go. Hoping for those three points. Uh, the Parc de Prince, and we're outside the wonderful Virage. Otea, and uh, this is where the orchards will uh, congregate tonight. Now we know there's going to be a little bit of a strike for 30 minutes, kind of with a protest of the players for their Champions League elimination against United, but also just some of the um, disappointments of Champions League exits in recent, in recent memory. So they're going to stay quiet. So we're very interested to see how that kind of rolls tonight. Anyway, let me introduce my son. This is Max, he's 13. He's been to the park once before. He was here last season for the Marseille game. But he's never stood with the Ultras, so he's super excited tonight. He's looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to it. We've got matching caps. We've just been to uh, the Champs Elysees to grab a, uh, a bit of merchandise at the boutique. Um, but we're ready to go in. Should we go in, Max? Yes. Okay guys, we're 10 minutes from kickoff. I'm not even gonna lie, this is the most surreal, strangest atmosphere I've ever seen in the park or ever felt in the park. Um, it's, it's incredibly strange. Even when the plays came out, nobody really kind of applauded them. Uh, there was a lot of hostility for the Marseille players, it's just quiet. It's for such a big game, it's very, very strange. Um, after the 30 minute strike, I, I expected to really pick up pick up well, but you know, it's um, as I said, it's, I've never felt nothing like this here before. Really haven't. It's uh, an interesting night. minutes that we first were thought was the case. We've got some ultras just down below us here. They're putting some banners up. They're putting some banners up. Obviously, I can't read it from what they um, displaying their displeasure from this now. Just about to kick off. One minute at half time. Great finish coming back. In. Great goal. It wasn't a great first half, but onwards and upwards. Let's get those three points. We're about to kick off. It is nearly 1 a.m. in the morning, and uh, we've got the train. Well, I've just got the train back, and uh, here we are. This is where I'm staying, Disneyland Paris. I'm here with the family. 
broke away a little bit to uh, go and watch my boys, PSG. Great win tonight in La Classique, 3-1. First half didn't really kind of amount to much. Bit of a cagey affair. Um, I think there was a little bit of apprehension from the players. Didn't know what to expect from the fans. Um, the fans did their protest. And then after that, really got behind the boys, which was really great to see. And um, some fantastic play. But Di Maria was incredible tonight. I thought he was uh, the real man in the match. Um, he was just, he caused all sorts of problems for, for Marseille and um, certainly, I mean, his two goals were fabulous. So great to see him on the score sheet. Mbappe played well, as did one or two others. It wasn't the best PSG display, but they didn't really need to, um, you know, kind of push into third, fourth gear to get that win tonight. Another routine win, that's uh, seven and a half years and counting over over our, our fierce rivals so fantastic really pleased it was a great night a lot happier than last time at the park um so as i said really great now all in all uh, a great three points and uh, a step closer to another league title just want to clear something very quickly first and foremost very happy that balotelli balotelli didn't take didn't have the opportunity to score it's pretty poor on the night but it didn't have the opportunity to score so we could reveal a little marcus rashford t-shirt which i find completely strange but then he's a strange guy himself um and secondly there's a few reports that the psd plays at the end didn't go over to the fans to uh, to applaud them. I uh, just want to clear up very quickly that the, the, the actual the ultras left about three or four minutes before the end of the game. Um, anyway, um, just as uh, I guess it's just a, a sign of we've uh, we've supported you tonight. We're happy that you won, but we're still not happy. So we're not going to forget what happened. Um, so before any newspapers stop spreading any vicious rumours or start to incite trouble that the ultras had already left so they packed up and left quite early um so there we go another successful trip um enjoyed it i hope you've enjoyed the video it's pretty late it's a pretty cold and i've got a busy day here with the kids tomorrow so i need to go and get myself some sleep thanks very much guys thanks for tuning in ali Parry.